Coming up on ABS TV. Still reeling from NAB? We'll simplify it with our NAB Top 5. Lenses in focus. We're talking great glass with Canon. And even a caveman can do it. Getting audio right with Genelec. ABS TV starts right now. Hello and welcome to this edition of ABS TV, coming to you from Advanced Broadcast Solution Studios right here in SeaTac, Washington. We're going to take you inside the broadcast integration industry, talk to trendsetters, look at some gear, and of course, have some fun. First though, the headlines. Hard times and high commodity prices are putting engineers on alert for copper thieves. KMBC in Kansas City was knocked off the air recently as thieves attempted to steal copper tubing, so watch it. Many MSOs and local station groups are finally reporting better revenues this year, with some groups up 40% year over year. And Univision's 24 network stations are getting the Ikigami GF cam for studio and ENG use. The cameras shoot to compact flash media in full HD through two-thirds inch CCD image sensors. ABS is very pleased to announce a strategic alliance with Advanced Systems Group based in Emeryville, California. ABS and ASG are working together to provide file-based solutions for broadcast, post-production, high-end corporate video, and house of worship clients. This alliance combines ABS's hardware integration expertise with ASG's data-centric solutions. You know, NAB can be a little bit of a mind blower. It's really information overload. And with budgets what they are, not everybody can afford to travel to go. That's why our team at ABS that did attend NAB, they came back with their top five picks. So here it is, the top five from NAB 2010. Number five, the TV Logic LEM 150W OLED 15 inch color monitor. Beautiful color rendition compared to an LCD, which when it goes to black will give you gray, not true black. This gives you rock solid, dead on black. 180 degree viewing angle, brilliant color as I mentioned before, and 3D capable. It's small, it's lightweight, the underlying technology is fantastic and it's going to lead to much bigger and better broadcast monitors of the future. Number four, the TSO line of audio monitoring. What they've been able to do is come up with a line of audio monitoring that's easy to use, looks sexy, and covers all the various formats that are out there. What these guys have done is created a really elegant solution to monitoring and logging loudness. With loudness being a major point of contention in today's broadcast, it's important to be able to monitor and log that information as it comes through the door. Number three, the Threality 3D Camera Rig. It has a UI that operates on an iPad that allows a stereographer to balance the stereographic shot with other cameras. It allows the stereographer to monitor the shot in real time so that the 3D image does not cause divergence to your eyes, which means no headaches in the theater. Number two, Fusion IO, IO Drive Duo. IO Drive Duo is a flash-based storage archive solution that replaces solid-state hard drives. It is a single-level cell or a multi-level cell drive that supports 1.4 gigabytes per second read and write capable. It has a native capability of 185,000 input operations per second, and you can stack these cards eight deep to give you eight gigabytes per second. And number one, the Broadcast Picks Granite. It offers 1080i processing with a full upgrade to 1080p. Gives you 22 inputs, 14 outputs, and continues with what Broadcast Picks has been offering for years, which is the Fluent Workflow, a very unique production system. That does it for this year's 2010 NAB Top 5. Hey, do you have a vote for your top five? Go ahead and email them to me at soundoff at advancedbroadcastsolutions.com and we may include them on an upcoming program. And welcome back to ABS TV. You might have some of the world's coolest audio production tools, but if you don't have good speakers and good acoustics analysis, you're really not operating at 100%. Well, Genelec was one of the guests here at our big event here in SeaTac, Washington, and they brought up some really cool solutions to help you get your sound right. Man has always struggled to get the best sound out of his speakers and the room. 
And that's if he had the time to even mess with it all. The Genelec team came to show us their latest bi-amplified DSP monitoring system that packs a big punch into a small package. It all starts with Genelec's powered speakers. The Finnish company was the first to build them and has been refining for 20 years now. With a powered speaker, the biggest win is you have an amplifier that's specifically designed to carry a certain load of either the, mid, the woofer or a mid-range or tweeter. So you can optimize the performance of the amplifier as a result, you get better sound quality. When mated with Genelec's powerful speaker management software, up to 30 can be networked and each calibrated specifically to the room using the AutoCal plugin that uses a series of test tones and a sensitive mic to map the room. Each Genelec speaker matches its mates, tested and built for reliability. And the AutoCal system can remember any room and any listening point. It all adds up to accuracy and the high-end sound reproduction used in places like the Sony and Fox scoring stages and all the major networks. You need to know exactly what you're hearing and you need to hear the best so if something is wrong in your EQ or your levels, you can hear it and then uh, accordingly adjust for it. You need to know that your speakers are going to sound the same, that your left and right are match, you have the same frequency response the same, they're adjusted for the same level, so it's a matched pair. Each speaker has dip switches for roll-off and tilt and parametric notch and shelving filters too. But the real power is in using the management software. For instance, what about time of flight? That's the slight differences between the arrival time of sound from each speaker. Well, no worries. So each speaker will hit you at exactly at the same time. If one speaker is further away, perhaps it has to be above that door so it's a little further than it should be. We'll delay all the speakers to match the distance there. So it hits you at the same time, at the same level, and EQ'd for the best audio possible. The 8000 series speakers feature wide waveguides, a multi-mode status light, input protections, metal cabinets which act like heat sinks for the amps, mounting hard points, an anti-chuffing port that doubles as a handle, an isopod insulator on the bottom of the speaker, and armored drivers. Yes, we've come a long way from the days when we tried to tune up our speakers ourselves, and Genelec is a leader in defining the state of the art. And that's going to do it for this edition of ABS TV. For all of us at Advanced Broadcast Solutions, I'm Tom Lyson. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.